My name is Laura Barber. I'm 42 years old and I have three hilarious sons and a perfect husband. He's perfect because I'm constantly using the wrong nouns and he's the only one that can understand what I'm trying to say. My oldest son is 18 and I have twins that are 14. We're all quick to laugh and can make the best out of almost anything. Our world's changed one day, out of nowhere, and we've never had a chance to look back. My name is Jeff Barber. I met Laura and her boys six years ago. We celebrated our second wedding anniversary on day 10 of her, of her chemo and radiation treatment. We first heard the word glioblastoma, July 17th, 2018. We were looking at an MRI scan that showed a huge tumor in my left frontal lobe. And we were listening to the neurosurgeon say words like inoperable, brain biopsy, tumor, and then glioblastoma. The only question I remember asking out loud was what should I tell my kids? How should I tell my kids? I was truly scared I would not be alive to see my oldest son graduate from high school nine months later. Our GBM crisis spread through the community so fast. The devastating news impacted everyone in a ripple effect. It was hard to know what to say to our loved ones. It was hard to see them cry. We cried and prayed as a community for two weeks straight. Once we had a treatment plan, we were able to focus. Our neighbors, friends, family, scouters, co-workers, and church family all jumped in to help in their own special way. After radiation, 105 chemo pills, a million answered prayers, my tumor did shrink. I was able to see my son graduate, and I fully expect to be alive and strong to see my twins graduate as well. But I need your help to make that happen. I need a cure. Glioblastoma patients and their families need a cure for this devastating disease. We need more research that will lead to better treatment options. You're invited to join us and thousands of others participating in GBM Awareness Day, July 17th. Your involvement is key to moving this research forward. Thank you for your commitment to help find a cure for GBMs. <laughs>